Hey, what's going on guys? It's Cole here, and today I'm bringing you another guide for the Black Ops 3 Zombies mod, Lost Place. In this video, we're going to be going over how to complete the full main quest easter egg on the map. In order to do this, you are going to need to know how to turn the power on and open up the Pack-a-Punch. If you need a guide for either of those, I will have both of them on my channel, and I have the links on screen and the description below to go and find them. So without any further ado, let's get into it. Before you can do any of the actual steps, you are going to need to turn the power on, so go ahead and do that before continuing with this guide. So once you have the power turned on, the first step is to go around the map and collect 5 rubies. The first one can be found just outside the church you spawn in right here. The second one can be found in this water pit just where you drop down by the bowie knife. The third one can be found sitting on the ground just behind Pack-a-Punch. The fourth one can be found on the floor just next to the stamina up machine. And the fifth and final one can be found by this gate that you have to open, just behind this wrecked car. Once you have collected all five, bring them back to this altar in spawn and put them all in their pedestals. Alright, now this step is easily the most confusing one to figure out at first when trying to do this easter egg. Thankfully, it's not that hard once you've got it down, it's just, it can take a bit of extra explaining for me to kind of get across. So to do this step, you're going to need to go up by Quick Revive and play the organ next to it in a certain way, and after you've completed it, it will keep playing a song afterwards to let you know that you've done it right. Now, to do this, we split up the piano keys. They're sectioned off in like little tile sets, so from left to right, we number them one to however many there even are. We don't even use all of them, so I don't know. But you're going to want to play the whole song. I'm going to have the notes, in quotes, up on screen. This is essentially like a tab. If you actually play music, just go by the sections left to right, count them out, and play these notes in this order. And you kind of want to do it pretty quickly. It, it shouldn't take you more than like 30 seconds to play all of them. Uh, and once you've done it successfully, the piano will keep playing the song and you will know that you've completed the step properly. Once you have all five rubies in place, and you have the organ playing the Pirates of the Caribbean theme, you can simply go up to the altar and press F to start the boss fight. It will put you on a 60 second timer before actually sending you in. Once you are in the boss, you shouldn't have too much of a problem so long as you have a pack punched gun. You will get one max ammo about halfway through the fight and then another one once you finish it. The only thing to really take note of is that you should try your best to not take damage during this fight, because every time that you do, the damage that you take is put back into his health and he regenerates it. Once you finish the fight, it will spawn in the Widow's Wine perk machine in the boss room as a little reward for you, and you can just grab it for free. And with that, you guys now know how to complete the easter egg on the Black Ops 3 Zombies mod, Lost Place. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did enjoy or if this video helped you out in any way, feel free to go ahead and leave a like, a comment, or a subscription. Any of those would be greatly appreciated. If you're looking for any more Lost Place guides or any other custom zombies guides, I have a lot more on my channel, and I have a lot more coming soon. So feel free to check the channel or the playlist in the end cards of the video for more. If you're interested in catching some Lost Place content live on Twitch or any other Zombies content live on Twitch, I will have a link to my channel on screen and the description below. I stream on there all the time and we'd love to have you guys come and chill out and chat. But with all that being said, once again, I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you all have a great rest of your day and goodbye.